What's up guys? We are the Sora Girls. My name is Kelsey. And my name is Becky. And today we decided to do the Instagram Decides Our Life. But instead of life, we're doing DIY because we're DIY. We do. we're, we're DIYs. Did you guys know that? I don't know if you knew that. Are you subscribed? You should subscribe. Notification bell? Okay, thanks. So we are gonna head to different locations and source things all via your answers on mm -hmm. our Instagram polls. We're doing it on our personal Instagram, so if you aren't following those, those will be linked below. Mm -hmm. And we are kind of just gonna do it as we go, get your answers and uh, DIY some things. I hope we make something cute together. I hope you guys make cute choices. <laughs> Otherwise, this is totally your fault, just kidding. It's a team effort. Okay, we're gonna start off by going to the thrift store for Becky's DIY. Let's go. Okay, we're at the thrift store. What did you just ask Instagram? I asked them whether I should do the fashion side of the thrift store or the home decor. What are you hoping for? Uh, I like home decor more personally, but I'm cool with whatever. Oh my God, well, let's see. We'll kill some time in between each post, but uh, we're not gonna give you guys that much time to decide because we have a lot of DIYing to do today. Hope you guys are on that Instagram and you're on it quick. <laughs> Should I get this for the Shania Twain concert? Okay, that started out as a joke and now I'm 100% getting this for the Shania Twain concert. Are you seeing those mirrors right now? So, decor won by 75%. You guys love decor too. We feel each other. So let's go check out some options. <laughs> like baskets could be cool. They rearranged our thrift store, eh? Made an old mantle. Wow, this one's a little bit better. A little bit. That little table's like actually kind of cute. <gasps> but like, what are you even gonna do with that? It's perfect. <gasps> are you actually kidding me right now? What? That's so funny. Ours is cuter still. This one's probably like twenty dollars. We are gonna give people the option of furniture or frames in one photo, kind of. So, furniture won by a whopping 68%. So, so, I guess you need to shop in this section. And I'm not gonna tell Instagram what I end up picking because I want to be surprised for them as they go along, but you guys get to see right now. Ooh, cute. Have you made a choice yet? I was thinking maybe this because I can actually use it and you could like paint the wicker like a cool pattern. Yeah, like a boho. Yeah. Add some tassels, do something fun. Okay. All right, I just picked up this wicker laundry hamper, which is very cute but also has a lot of potential. Now we got to figure out from Kelsey's Instagram where we're going for hers. We're trying to figure out if we should go to the hardware store or the fabric store. Let's ask the gram. <laughs> Hey guys, today we're doing the Instagram chooses my blank challenge. So I need your help to answer some polls to help me out with this DIY. Okay, so I asked um, where we should go because my choice was fabric store or hardware store. And hardware store is winning 55% to 45%. Oh, it's, it's super so close. close. We're going to the hardware store. Also, can we get lunch first, Becky? Yes. I asked on my Insta polls if we should do salad or sandwiches for lunch. So warm. Okay, so now you guys need to help me decide whether I'm gonna make something for the wall or something for the floor. Vote below. What are they gonna choose? <laughs> guys, we've been waiting and this is the closest poll to date. Oh baby. We'll wait a little bit longer, I guess. It's too close, too close for comfort. Too close to call. Okay, um, so I just told Becky to go vote for floor because I want that one to win and she just made it like 50-50. Come on. Come on. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? You're kidding. Okay, literally been waiting for like 20 minutes. We are getting mad dirty looks from like every employee and customer in here. It is still at 50%. It keeps bouncing back and forth and it's like right now 50%. I'm gonna be the tiebreaker right now and we're gonna make it for the floor. Okay. Okay. Not that many options. <laughs> like, do you want a cheese bill like? <laughs> I think I'm gonna go tall. You don't think anything. We're gonna ask Instagram. Here we are? Yeah. Oh no! <laughs> okay, so 71% chose tall. So we're gonna get the tall legs. All right, we are back to working on my DIY project and we are heading to the fabric store currently and I'm gonna get you to pick out what fabric I want. Because it's a laundry hamper and it has fabric in it already, I wanna replace it with something new and clean. 
so they're gonna tell me what color we're gonna do. Nice. Should I all of a sudden start making pants or continue with my DIY? Whoa, plot twist. Whoa. Abandon the DIY or not? Like, you wanna say cotton, right? It's like linen. Linen? Linen. Linen? Wow. Wow. Pirate AF. Can this be an option? No. Lin no. <laughs> okay, did you find something you like? Yeah, so I have two options either a light white or a gray gray. Two very different vibes. Let's see what they say. Let's see what they say. Alright, light won that one, so we are gonna grab that and go back to the office. Audio montage of us getting in the car. Okay, we're back at the office and I'm gonna ask Instagram whether I should paint or stain. Let's see what they choose. What's your question for the audience? I'm glad you asked. I wanna paint my hamper like either like a solid color or I do a pattern on it and I'm gonna use these papers to represent it. I feel like you're like tricking the audience here. I know, it's actually kind of funny because they might think I'm using this exact paper but I'm just gonna ask them pattern or plain and use this to represent it. Sneaky, sneaky. Oh, I see, I see, I see. You, here we go like that, okay. Got the shot. Let's wait to find out what the answer is. <laughs> so, stain or paint? Winner is, oh my god. My poles are always so close. 54% painting. So we're going to paint. Okay, so cast out of the bag, I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna be making today. Ever since we redid the loft, this plant got repotted and it just kind of sits on the ground and it looks a little sad sitting on the ground. So I want to make it a very short stool inspired plant stand. So I bought those legs, the tall ones, thanks to the Instagram fam. And now I'm going to use some MDF because we have it laying around the office. You guys hate it when we say that, but I'm sure we'll run out of MDF one day. But you can use a wood or anything. I don't know why you guys are upset why we say that. It's just we're using materials that we have. That's so much better than buying new things. So I'm going to cut out um, a circular size that's just a little bit bigger than the base of my pot here. All right, so it's been a bit, and after lots of votes, the clear winner here was Pattern. So, my plan is to use a paintbrush and some white paint and paint like a boho y pattern print onto this laundry hamper. Okay, so my patterned paint job actually turned out really cute. I honestly was like a little nervous when that one won because I didn't totally have a plan, but I really like how it's working out. Now I'm gonna jump back to the light color pattern that won the vote and cut out the bag that's gonna run the inside of this. So I'm gonna cut one long strip, and that's gonna be the front, the bottom, and the back, and then two pieces for the side, and sew that all together. Okay, the last question I'm gonna ask Instagram is, straight or angled? Because I'm gonna do a little something something with the pot. All right, let's see what they say. We have 57% are at angled and 43% are at straight. So I asked this question because my pot here, it's a little plain, it's a little white. So I wanted to spice it up because it is like a blank canvas. I was either gonna do maybe like a straight color blocking um, effect, but I guess now I'm gonna do an angled color blocking effect because the InstaFam voted for angled. I have one more question for you guys, and that is I want to put like a decal or some sort of like latch or like tie on the front to pull up the top easier. And I want to know if I should do that out of cord and do like a tassel y thing, or should I do it out of faux leather and do some sort of like pull tab? You guys let me know on Instagram in like 10 minutes. Thanks. How's that going? Um, good. The only thing is that because this paint is really thick, when I peeled off the tape, it kind of peeled off some of. My line, so I'm just gonna come through with this. And oh, true, that works so well. I'm almost done though. Yay! 
All right, you guys wanted the faux leather, so uh, let's get to making this. Matching patterns is very important. And then I just strung a piece of twine underneath the little tabby I made and tied it to the top here and that's complete, y'all. Y'all, who am I? Painted, stool, painted, plant. Oh, oh, oh. What? No, oh, it just looks heavy. It is heavy. Yes, so cute. Into it, it's gonna have a new home in the living room. Yes, yes, yes. DIYs turned out. What do you guys think? I mean, you, we, I think everybody did a good job here. I think they turned out really cute. Let us know if your votes were the winning votes, and if you guys didn't vote, should we do this again? Yeah, so that you can vote. Make mm -hmm. sure you're following the Sorry Girls on Instagram, Kelsey Marillas on Instagram, Becky Lynn on Instagram, so you don't miss out on stuff like this in the future. Yes! Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like it, make sure you give it a like. If you love it, make sure you sub it. We'll see you next time. Oh, Sorry. Bye. See you next time. Bye. <laughs>